guys, Dama here. Welcome back to my channel. I'm here all cozy. I literally have this blanket on my lap. Enjoying my coffee. It's so delicious. I'm just over here chilling and I'm about to head out the door. I'm gonna go do my hair. Finish up Christmas shopping. Ugh, it's only what? Two what? Today's Saturday, Sunday month. Two days left till Christmas Eve, so three days till Christmas Day. And I am so so excited, you guys. Christmas is my favorite time of year. If you guys were to come to my house, you would see how obsessive I am with Christmas and anyone around me. Like, I was literally just playing Christmas music. I would play it through the video, but then you guys couldn't hear me. So that's why I'm not doing it. Oh, let me close the doors. like really loud over here. So anyways, it's kind of chilly these days. Um, we've had like a couple days of cold weather, so I'm really, really excited. But anyways, I was recently at Sephora and I was buying some uh, more Christmas gifts and all that. And I went a little crazy and bought some stuff for myself and actually the, these buys that I made um, were mainly um, because I had some discounts they had some discounts going on and all that good stuff I think they had like 20% off the first time I went then they had like 15 off 75 something like that so these are things I've actually bought and then last couple of weeks and um it is actually going to be my last Sephora haul for the year and I have all everything sitting right here in front of me three bags of goodies that I got all for myself okay so before we get started if you're new to my channel don't forget to subscribe before you leave and hit that notification bell if you want to get notified every time I post a video I post a video every week and if you are back to my channel well then welcome back and if you like what you see please give this video a big big thumbs up I would really appreciate it and without further ado let's just jump right in the very first product in here is the it cosmetics Marcellar water this one you see right here. I love It Cosmetics Pretty. I have so many products of theirs and I have no complaints of any other products, but I can put my chair up. The Marcellar water is specifically, I like it because it's good for brightening, anti-aging, and um, cleanses makeup. So usually the way I use it, I think it would be the correct way of using it. I'm not, I'm not sure, but um, I would use my Clinique Take Off the Day remover and that's the one that's like a cream or gel consistency and then I will get a cotton pad and go in with the marcellar water and then just cleanse off my face and it is so good you guys so when you're removing like eye makeup it's a little harder to get it all out so what I do is I'll get the cotton pad and I'll just lay it in there for like 10-15 seconds and this literally gets all the junk out it's amazing and it's supposedly really good like in theory for your skin all together so a cleanser that is also good for your skin treatment for me is always a plus plus. and this costs I believe $38 I'm not too sure but I'll link it down below for you guys and I'll actually link everything that I will be mentioning to you today down below the next thing i got so this is like all skincare i guess what i'm mentioning right now is my favorite moisturizer of all time when i say all time i mean this is like the third time i've bought this and this is the caress pomegranate balancing cream gel moisturizer it's for oily to combination oily skin and it's this one right here and I love, 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 love this moisturizer. And I have very oily skin. And the reason why I like it so much is because I feel like ever since I started using this moisturizer, my skin has changed so much. Like, it helps with some sort of oil control in a sense. Because whenever I use this moisturizer, I don't even need to use primer of any sort. I feel like my skin um, does so good. It's... It's, it's just perfect. Caress is actually, I believe, a Japanese company. Don't quote me on that. But their products are very different from most. Um, if you guys look into that, you'll see what I'm talking about. But they have very good products. Oh my god, yes. Okay, so the next thing I have in here are these Nest holiday candles. Yes, first of all, the packaging is gorgeous. This is like a velvet material. It just feels so pretty. And oh my god, they smell so good. Okay, so the red one is, what's the scent of the red one? 
Okay, so it doesn't say what it is. The aroma of a sparkling holiday season is created by blending uh, pomegranate, mandarin orange, pine, cloves, and cinnamon with a hint of vanilla and amber. So I guess they just described the notes for this one and it's it really smells amazing. I can't wait to light this. Okay, and then the other one is birchwood pine and it's made with white pine, fire, fir balsam, and birchwood over a base of rich musk and amber. This one smells more woodsy, but I like them both very much and they retail for $16. And weirdly enough, I've never heard of this brand before or I have, but I've never purchased anything of this brand. These would be the first items I purchased. I'll let you guys know if I like it or not, but it smells really good and I'm loving it. This is not much, but I like carrying a makeup wipe removers in my bag in case I ever need any. And so Sephora sells these little mini travel ones for, I don't know, I think $5 or something like that. So I just picked this up on my trip there. Um, now here's a couple things I did want to try that I haven't used before. So they're having, like I said, a sale and this is the cute little flamingo brushes by Tarte. I thought this is the cutest little thing ever. So it brings four brushes. Just I'll open it and show you guys. Oh, it's so pretty. I've been dying to get a little brush like this, and this seems so comfy. And the brush feels so perfect. And here are the other two. They look like pineapple, not flamingos. Here are the flamingos. They're so cool. Oh, oh, the whole thing's coming apart. And there's this big one. It's so fluffy. I just like the design of it. It's so cute. And I definitely have an obsession with cute brushes that I will not even use. So I don't know. I don't know if I'll try using these or not. And then the next item I picked up is these, this Tarte Tardiest uh, Shimmery Lip Paint. And I like it because it has like the perfect glittery colors. And I like using lip glosses more in the winter. Cause you know, they keep your lips all moisturized and it has like that iridescent pink color. What did I do? Oh my God, it's not even coming off on camera right now. You see that? It's so pretty. It's gorgeous. Okay, and then the next item I picked up, it is so funny. I don't know why I have been obsessed with buying the Marc Jacobs colored eyeliner and I have been thinking about buying the red one for, I don't know, like the whole year. And I finally picked it up because I'm like, I'm going to use it for my look for Christmas day. And this is in the color Fine Wine. And it is the prettiest red ever. I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it in the back of my hand so you guys can see that. It's this beautiful deep red, I just, just love it it's so nice and I love all the Marc Jacob liners um, they're amazing the consistency is so good and thick and creamy and I honestly feel like it is the only eyeliner that I have personally ever used that actually lasts on my waterline because I have very watery eyes and any eyeliner I tend to put fades off so that's why my trick is I just put dark shadow in my bottom lash line if I am trying to apply eyeliner because or else it will not last but the Marc Jacobs eyeliner for me really do so I highly recommend it they are very pricey for eyeliners in my opinion it's $25 for one of these but I think it's worth it because the quality is truly there so I would spend that money on this any day so the very next thing I got is the Fenty Beauty by Rihanna uh, highlight in the color Trophy Wife. You guys, I've been wanting this for so, 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 so long. And I don't know why. I, I think I even purchased it once and went and returned it. Because I'm like, what am I going to do with this color? I'm going to show you guys how intense this color is. Like, first of all, this packaging is pretty big for the highlight in itself like of what it is but watch this you guys do you guys see the intensity of this highlight like this is insane 
and it's honestly not even coming off on camera as strong as that highlight really is it's insane but I'm like you know what I've been wanting to get this I can treat myself to this I think it's a little crazy and overpriced in a sense because this highlight costs $34 36 dollars something like that and in my head i'm like how often am i really going to use this high for this because there's highlights that cost more and just as much and i would be willing to buy it as well it's just in this case it's that that color is so intense and i don't see myself using it very often so that's why i was always iffy about this highlight but the fact that I couldn't get it on my head, I'm like, you know what? Forget it. I'm just going to buy it because I want it, and that's that. And so that's what I did. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. And the next item I got is this beautiful Huda Beauty Ruby Obsession palette. And Huda Beauty has been doing so good these days. I mean, always, actually. But particularly because these little palettes, ever since they came out, they're being sold like crazy oh man got my nail in there i wanted to get a red one for christmas days and it is just the cutest little palette ever they have the most beautiful colors look at that beautiful like black ruby color it is so pretty yeah so i'm really excited about using this like i said it was about 27 dollars. they have different colors they have a green one a blue one pink one a very like warm tone like orangey colors I know they have a bunch of them the next thing I got that I was super excited about was the Becca be a light um, face palette and I've actually used this like the day I got it and then I put it back and have completely forgotten about it but let me show you guys how beautiful this palette is first of all the packaging uh, hello to die for and then the colors the way they come off oh let me show you guys a highlight let me grab my highlight brush so I'm gonna show you guys this beautiful highlight all right let me do this so you guys can see it so this palette is perfect if you are on the go so the first one here on this side is your brightening powder the top one is like your blush slash highlight. The bottom one is your contour. And this one is like your blurring powder. But these two can work as highlights depending on your skin because they both, actually all the colors has like that glittery shimmer underneath it. So it can pretty much work for any skin tone and that's why I like them so much. I think they are great when it comes to that. And this palette is our I don't know if it still is but was on sale for $29 and it's amazing it's so worth the cash the beauty blender I needed a new one so I picked one up so there's that not much to talk about $16 or 20 no it's $20 beauty blenders are $20 okay and then the next thing I got was that I thought was so cute is this Too Faced Better Than Sucks Mascara. It is my favorite mascara and it comes in to hang it on the little tree. So I thought this would be really cute as a gift and then I decided to get one for myself as well with the excuse of, oh, I would always need a little travel mascara to put in my bag. But let's be honest, I just wanted to get this because it just looked cute there. And that one was for $12. And then, because I shopped too much, I collected two of my perks using my points. They were each like they're each worth $500. So this one is um, just skincare stuff by Celsius by a beauty company I've never heard, and I want to try it. I mean, I've seen the name, but I've never used it, and I will not try to pronounce it because I don't want to butcher it. And then the other one I got is the Way Hair Care Collection. It is so cute. It brings the texturizing spray, the leave-in conditioner, hair oil, and finishing cream. And I really love their Wave Spray. If you guys haven't used their Wave Spray, you are not living. That is the best thing ever. So definitely go and pick that up. Okay, so the next item in here is the Fenty Beauty. Again, I was on my Fenty Beauty shopping. 
Bomb Baby Mini Face Set. So this brings the Mini uh, Hustler Baby, the Mini Hustler Baby Highlight, and then the Gloss. I've never actually tried the Gloss, but a lot of people talk about how good it is, so I've been wanting to buy it. And since um, I don't go through gloss like crazy, I'm like I might as well buy the box. I might as well buy the little one because I'm sure I'll use it just as much as if I were to use the big one and it's never going to run out really, I promise. So this is the highlight. It's the cutest little thing ever. It is this pretty pink, peachy pink. And then the last thing I purchased were the lashes I'm actually wearing today. These are the Lily Lashes in the style Miami. These are definitely one of the most expensive eyelashes I've purchased. They cost $30, but I saw them and I was obsessed. That's it, that was my last purchases for, ooh, 2018 at Sephora. Absolutely live at that store. I already hit VIB Rouge once again for next year. And I would have shared with you all the fun stuff I purchased for gifts, but I don't want to, I know some of the people that I bought the gifts for actually watch my videos. I don't want to ruin it for them. Even though they probably wouldn't have known that it was their gift. But whatever. I still don't, they don't want to post it on here. But anyways, I'm not going to get into that. I am so, so excited to dive right into all these new products. I will be using them for some of my videos that will start off very soon in 2019. Um, my next video will actually be on a New Year's Eve look, which I'm really, really excited about. I wanted to do one for Christmas, but I honestly do not have the time for it. And I wasn't really inspired with anything, and I was more excited about doing a New Year's look, so that's what I went with. But anyways, you guys, thank you so much for tuning in today. I really hope you guys enjoyed, and I hope you guys have yourself a very merry little Christmas. You guys got that? Got that? quoting songs now. Try and get something to eat. Gotta go do my hair. And I will see you guys on the next one. Mwah. Bye guys.